Hi guys, this is Hyunmin Max, aka Max. Welcome back to another video on the channel. So for today, right, we're actually going to be talking about, of course, the Trophy Titans Team 2. I'm going to be talking about what are some of the content that we have already seen, the upcoming content that we will see, right? We're going to talk a bit about the market and, of course, most importantly, right, how to make coins, what to invest in. So for yesterday, right, we actually gotten this Throwback Winners SBC, which is actually quite a big surprise. Now the key thing to note about this SBC right is that all these packs that you see right here right everything in this segment right they are all tradable so you know people are very very inclined to go and complete this because all these are tradable right because you can sell all these cards that you pack for coins so the highlight of the whole thing of this right this throwback winners is this 50k pack after you have completed the six segments so yesterday if you actually know how to do SBC solution trading, like I've always mentioned, right? Um, for this particular segment of the SBC, right? The Premier League part, whereby you need 31 chemistry and you need one Man City player, right? You know, the cards needed for this SBC basically flew. So let me show you an example, right? I actually did a little bit of SBC solution trading yesterday, right? So I actually managed to pick up a couple of um, Kevin Phillips myself and I managed to sell them. So as you can see, they sold for about 3 to 4k, right? I actually have, um, I bought more, but I already cleared them off my transfer list because I don't have any space. So I still have a couple here, right? I just want to show you that uh, I picked them up for a very, very low price. Right, there you go. I bought them for about 1,000 coins, right? I have quite a number more that I didn't manage to sell all. But, you know, no worries. Because right now, he is still at 2.4k. So, those are actually um, easy coins, right? SBC, SBC solution trading, right? Really easy. Your John Stones, right? He went from about 9... Let me see, 950 coins, yep all the way up to his current price of about 3k i think he peaked at about 3.2 to 3.3k 3 as well so you also have other players like uh saka right saka was about you know this card price he went up all the way to 2.7 2.8k even and then right now he's back down at 1.5k so you know maybe one day we can do some sbc solution trading live on my twitch stream Right, we'll see because it's actually super super profitable you buy the cards within one to two hours you can sell them immediately for profit so what happened is right those tradable packs that you saw right the trophy winners they actually brought down brought down the prices of the trophy titans team 2 right so if you take a look at somebody like um frank lampard right the 94 version lampard which I was actually reviewing for the YouTube channel. When I actually reviewed him and I tried him out, you know, he was about 600k or so. I sold him at about 630k. So he dropped all the way down to about 500k right now. So that's a very huge drop off, 100k or so. So do remember to check out my review on Lampard, right? We actually also have somebody like Michael Owen. So he went from about 500k all the way down to about 360k. Again, that's a huge drop off. We have somebody like Stevie G as well, right? 94 rated Stevie G, right? Uh, again, I was trying him out for my YouTube channel. He went from about four, I saw him at about 470k, right? He went all the way down to about 330k right now. That's like a 130k drop, right? A huge, huge drop off, you know? I see his price falling more along with the rest of the Team 2 cards, right? So, I mean, all these cards at your peril, I will probably sell them. And again, you know, if you guys want to check out how um, Gerard plays, do check out the review once it's completed. So what happens when all these player prices go down so much, right, is it actually gives us an opportunity to invest. So, you know, somebody like 89 Socha, it's actually a really good pickup. I would say uh, for console players, you can probably get him for less than 35k. I wouldn't go beyond 35k. For PC players, I wouldn't go beyond 35.5k or so for Sosha. 
uh, another card that I think is actually pretty good is your 89 Douglish, right? Um, for console players, I would say 35.5k for Douglish. For PC players, um, 35k for Douglish, right? So why do I pick out um, 89 Sosha and 89 Douglish? Because players like that, they have two functions. Number one, they are usable in game. So if you look at King Kenny, four star skill moves with five star weak foot. Can you imagine a card of this level with this kind of stats, right? Being at almost like for the price, you know, it's absolutely crazy, which also tells me that the power curve has shifted significantly, right? You should be having really good players in your team right now. Anyway, uh, so he's, as I was saying, he's number one, he's usable. Number two, he doubles up as very good fodder for your big boy gamble SBCs, right? Like your hero, hero pack, your icon pack, or your hero pick, or icon pick. You know, Sosha and Douglish will probably rise when all these big boy S SBCs, right, actually come out. So the next thing I actually want to talk about is uh, the objective that we have actually gotten from EA, right? This trophy, trophy, um, Titans Cup. So I think, um, because some of you have been telling me that your club is running dry, right? You guys have ran out of fodder completely. So, you know, EA to the rescue, I guess. So this cup actually gives you quite a bit of good fodder, right? You, you know, you just have to play the Trophy Titans Cup. And then when you complete it, you get an 85 by 5, right? As well as a 84 by 5, so on and so forth. So all these are good packs, you know, I have to say, right? The only thing to take note is um, the limit for this is only 5 matches per day. So another way to restock your club, if it's really dry, right? This daily dip which refreshes every single day. It's quite simple, you know. You just have to win a game, right? You just have to play three games. Within that three games, score five goals and win one of them. This can be in rivals, champs, or squad battles, which is actually, you know, so easy to do, right? Basically, you just play any game mode, right? And you'll get those, those free stuff. We actually also gotten the Fang Lampard objective, right? You have to play about 40 games to get him. You know, again, you get the 90 version, you get the um, 86 rated version of Lampard, and you get, you know, some fodder packs. So, um, I have actually tried the 94 Lampard version out. So I know even though their stats are kind of different, but they're attacking and defending AI, you know, it's going to be really, really similar. So do check out my 94 Lampard review, right? Because... I think it will definitely affect your decision on whether to complete 93 Lampard or not. This is especially important when you're deciding between completing Lampard or Dennis Burkham, right? Because EA made it in such a way that, you know, they required 6 Dutch players for Burkham. They require 6 English players for Lampard. So they basically made it impossible for you to combine the two objectives to do together. So if you're somebody who's a little bit more busy, you know, busy with other things in your life, then you probably will want to check out my Frank Lampard review to decide on which or which one of the two you should do because it's a you know it's a hell lot of um, squad battle games right so do check the review out so I actually want to go through a very low budget trading method that is repeatable every single week right it's a zero risk method and you know if you have less than 200k you know this method will work well for you right especially for those people who only have 10 to 20k coins right this is the perfect trading method for you right now so you search up the labor the Taurus cards you know pretty easy all right set the max price at 200 go bid for all these cards between 150 to 200 coins maximum and then you can actually sell them off immediately straight away for about 550 coins right continuously flip flip them you know if you want to be a little bit more patient i would say you wait for monday they probably would sell between 600 to 650 coins right easy coins with zero risk right another trading method the suda americana cards again same thing right you get them for about between 150 to 200 coins look at this they are all relatively easy to get you can actually sell them straight away for about 550 coins right so easy again you can actually wait for monday for them to go a little bit higher 600 to 650 
you know, I would say if you need those coins, just keep keep flipping them, right? And you're gonna go from 10k to 20k, 20k to 40k, right? Um, is it a little bit grindy? Yes, but you know, if you want to make coins, that's the that's one of the few ways, all right? So great for people with um low budget with very little coins. So we actually gotten a couple of uh, player SBCs as well, right? We got this Claudio Macchio at Content Drop on Friday. So I've done a review on him, so do watch the review because you know he's relatively expensive to craft at about 1.2 million coins based on the current fodder prices. So that's a lot of fodder to commit and you know you probably have to spend some coins so do check out the review right he is four star four star with high high work rates right uh i mean if you look at the stats i don't think that there's anything wrong with the card so we also have gotten this raul sbc as well right he's high medium four star skill moves and finally he gets the upgrade to a five star weak foot so if you look at the stats absolutely absolutely crazy cracked out stats Right, so you know it's about 550k to complete you know and you know it i'm gonna be reviewing him later in the weekend league so do keep a lookout for my review so i know the big question you guys have right now right is what to invest in for the for these next few days so i actually like you know i think 83s are all right you can um pick them up for about 800 to 850 coins uh on bid right so if we look through the rest of the um, fodder, right, I actually like the looks of 84s, right? So 84s, right, you can get them for about, um, for, for console players and PC players both, right, get them for about 3k on bid, right? The maximum you should go is 3.2k. If you're lazy, you know, you just want to buy now, it's fine. If you actually pick them up after squad battle rewards, right, it should be relatively easy to get them for below 3,000 coins. So how much will they go up to? I'm foreseeing they're gonna easily rise up to about 4k or so, right, uh, minimally by Wednesday, latest Thursday. So I wouldn't be surprised if they go up to maybe even 5,000 coins, right, if we have a specific requirement for some SBCs. So for your 85 rated players, um, for console players, get them for about 8.3k or so. For PC players, right, you want to get them for 8.6k max. So they should go up to about 10k or so within the next week or so. Your 86s, right, your 86s. Uh, get them at 13k max for console players. For PC players, get them for 13250k max. So again, they should rise up to about 15k or so, right, within the next week. So for your 87s, right, your 87s, get them for below 18k for both console and PC players. They're going to go up to about 20 to 21k. So which ones are my favorites, right? Personally, right, I would be splitting um, 70 to 80% of my coins or putting 70 to 80% of my coins on 84s, right? And then the, the rest, 20% would go into 86s, right? I'm focusing on these two. I foresee 84s to do really really well over the upcoming week now if you want to put two mil three mil four mil into 84s i say go for it i don't see any risk at all and the upside is really high like i said they can go up to 5k right so personally i'm sending my about one mil or so that i have into 84s and 86s like i mentioned the best time to pick this cuts up uh, typically after your squad battle rewards because their prices would dip right so the next thing i want to show you guys is how much coins the people in my discord have been making right so if you take a look here i'm not sure i think you guys could uh can just about see right this uh this person in my discord right he bought 86s for 14k and he sold them for about um 16 to 16.5k Right, he bought the 85 rated informs for 10k or so, sold them off at 12k. Another viewer, same thing, bought 86s at about 14k, sold them off at about 16250k. And we have another one, right? Um, he also bought the uh, 86 rated informs and 86 at 14k and sold them off at about 16k or so, you know. 
so so many of them actually make uh coins off my trading tips in the discord like i mentioned i can't make trading videos every day but i do make sure the people in my discord gets daily trading tips so you know do join out the trading discord while it's actually still free so i myself right i've been making coins as well of course right i bought into the tips that i give other people right so the key thing to note here is take a look at the coin balance on top with every changing picture right so again i bought 86ers at 14k and i sold them at between 16 to even 18k for selected 86ers so take a look at this right it, it has went up to 360k right 420k right and then 500k and then you know 600k right take a look at the number of 86ers that i have gone in on and you know they're all selling i have to say guys sometimes you know exercise a bit of patience right even cuts takes time to sell right you won't they won't all sell out immediately after you list them unless you want to go for lesser profit you know but i say exercise a little bit of patience right take a look at this i'm up to 800k all this in a matter of an hour or so right all just 86s so easy right um i even managed to sell some 86 rated inform for about 16.5 16750 all these are so so easy you know all these coins are so easy and i have another one of my viewer right this guy buying 86 rated informs for 14k like i've tipped him to do in the discord so i'm not sure what you guys are waiting for you know the trading discord is still free to join you know do join up and make some easy coins with us man i foresee there's so much more coins to be made especially within the next two upcoming weeks we're gonna make so much coins you can easily double triple your coins Tr trust me man trust me on this right nobody in my discord has ever lost any coins so yeah i mean i've actually come to the end of the video right if you guys enjoyed the video hit that like button and we are in the weekend league period right now if you're struggling with your weekend league do check out my 16 wins weekend league tactic whereby lots of people have been telling me they've been getting between uh three to four more extra wins just by copying my tactic right so do check my tactic video out if you want to see more player reviews trading videos you know how to craft sbcs how to improve your gameplay basically anything fifa related you know hit that sub button man i'm sure i can help you out a lot all right and i'm out all right take care guys